uh, I love what I do. I I've always uh, said this that love what you do and uh, do what you love. The roles have been reversed, and it was so exciting for me that I could ask uh, the guests whatever I want to. And it was very like when I was saying in the promo also that you know not just a chat show Sunday seven thirty p.m. It felt like a dream come true because I have always loved chat shows. I love reality shows. I want to inspire people. I uh, want to do amazing challenges. Uh, you know which makes my craft. more and more fine uh, i'm really excited for the for my journey in korea because it's very different the language is different the content is different and i'm very very excited sharukh khan obviously who doesn't know sharukh khan we all love sharukh khan so uh, they know sharukh khan they know some of the films uh, older films mostly uh, they're really hyped about uh, indian food they love indian food which is ंगलीफ्टेडिंगलीफ्टेडिंगलीफ्टेडिंगलीफ्टेडिंगलीफ्टेडिंगलीफ्टेडिंगलीफ्टेडिंगलीफ्टेडिंगलीफ्टेडि
the best part is that there's so much more to do right and uh, i didn't know when i started i didn't know that I, i want to become an actor i just started because you know it just happened and then you know uh, as i started doing shows started doing my work i love i just fell in love with this craft and uh, now that i look back at this amazing journey i just feel that It, it's so amazing that i've met so many people worked with so, such talented people i have uh, seen myself grow in front of cameras i've not uh, missed out on anything fortunately uh, thanks to my parents and my friends because as soon as i would have any time uh, to spare i would you know go for a holiday uh, spend time with my friends just chill just be a normal human being basically and uh, being an influencer comes and a different responsibility because you know when when you have 38 million followers it's a huge responsibility to you know uh, just put out stuff that people like and learn something out of it uh, wherever i go i just keep that in mind so i love my job and i just want to do this for life and uh, it's been an amazing journey and i look forward to doing inspires like inspiring stuff i want to inspire people i uh, want to do amazing challenges uh, you know which makes my craft more and more fine so yes i'm looking forward for an amazing journey and you also made your korean debut so could you share that experience with us absolutely it was amazing uh, that i went to korea it was just so unexpected they uh, approached me and they were like why don't you uh, come to korea and let's figure something out let's do something and i then i signed with the agency for a film and for a web show and for more stuff so when i went to korea uh, recently it was just amazing i had so many meetings lined up i had to meet like big big people over there and it was just amazing because i felt like i was kind of representing india because i was the first ever actor to do something like this so uh i'm really excited for the for my journey in korea because it's very different the language is different the content is different and i'm very very excited so in one of your interviews you just said that you know where while talking about k dramas and all you said you wish bts comes to india so that we can go to bts yeah. courses i'm asking you this because i am a huge bts fan Who yeah me too yeah my bias my bias is definitely going to be v because okay v hands down <laughs> mine is nanjun <laughs> yeah oh yeah. My, mine is v for the longest time and i seriously want them to come to india i mean i was telling them also when i was in korea i was like do, do they have a concert here are they performing are they here somewhere they were like no they are in the us i was like oh no i come to korea and they are not even in the country i was like so sad but i really hope to see their concert right like I love the I I love Blackpink members as well. They're all so cool. I mean, just want to meet them once. They're so cool. Yeah, same. <laughs> so you know, like uh, people have huge craze for Korean content in India. So while while yeah. while moving in Korea, what kind of content do they watch? Do they watch Indian shows or what are they hyped up about? So uh, they are hyped up. So they firstly. watch a lot of different kind of content they have watched some hindi films but they don't have like a huge like they don't they don't know about it that much like they don't know about our culture that much unfortunately and that's why when i was in korea every meeting i was going in every people i was every person i was meeting i was like you know telling them about my culture as well like you know our culture our our industry our films and everything so uh, they don't know a lot about it but they know some people like they know shahrukh khan obviously who doesn't know shahrukh khan we all love shahrukh khan so uh, they know shahrukh khan they know some of the films uh, older films most uh they're really hyped about uh, indian food they love indian food which was which came as a surprise for me because i was like oh they they know about indian food and actually korean food some of the recipes are inspired from indian spices and our curry is inspired like uh yeah they get inspired from our indian curry so they have that in their dish and i was like oh that is that tastes like uh, our food they're like yeah because it is inspired from your uh, culture so i was like oh that's so cool so there is a co- connection between korea and india even though it's it's very little right now but i see in the future it becoming more stronger and stronger since we love them so much and they love guests like they the way they uh, treated me the way they welcome me welcome me it was just so sweet and warm 
so i just had a great time and i can't wait to go back again it's just a beautiful place that's so sweet to know so that brings me to my last question and talking of shahrukh khan in one of your interviews you had mentioned that you would like to star in om shanti om remake with adil <laughs> movie <laughs> yes i remember that i remember so that because om shanti om of course that's what happened i watched the guardian i love <laughs> the two films that i really really love uh, of shahrukh khan actually i love all of his films but two films are like my favorite one is chennai express and one is om shanti om so if there's a remake ever i would love to do that remake like i would do it for free seriously i would do anything to just be in om shanti om because i loved om shanti om ha- i watched it 50 times and since aryan is shahrukh sir's do- uh, son so i was like that is like the best combination and dipika you know had her debut with om shanti om yeah. if i'm not wrong so she yeah. had just entered the industry so she was like a new face and shahrukh sir was there so it would be so cool no like a remake <laughs> <laughs> okay so those were my questions for you uh, and all the best for your uh, show and all your upcoming projects good luck. thank you thank Have you nice so day. much thank you you too